And another safety alert. The first thing many think about during the 4th of July, of course, are fireworks. NBC 15's James Gordon is in Daphne tonight. James, it's that time of year again to remind people about the do's and don'ts. That's right, Lance. You know, the professionals are setting up the fireworks display here at Tryon Park in Daphne, as you can see right behind me there. And this is probably the safest way to enjoy fireworks. Still, many of you choose to shoot up your own at home. Okay. On a day like today, fireworks at the corner stand are selling like hotcakes. This means many of you will be having a backyard display tonight. Some do it every year, and they say the plan is to keep everybody safe. To make sure nobody gets hurt, man. We, we, we usually have like a designated firecracker person, <laughs> and then, you know, the rest of everybody else, they'll stand back or whatever and then watch the designated person light the fireworks and let them go out. Most cities have an ordinance prohibiting the shooting of store-bought fireworks. Those corner stands are usually located in the county's jurisdiction. But still, firefighters everywhere know some folks are going to buy them and use them. Don't launch fireworks towards another person. Don't launch them towards somebody's home or their property. Make sure you have a garden hose or a bucket of water nearby in the event there is a fire. And then also just follow any of the safety guidelines or directions that are on the packaging. Good advice. Now, folks are already setting up their chairs out here to enjoy the fireworks display here at Tryon Park. Those fireworks start as soon as it gets dark, around 8 o'clock or so. Now we're live in Baldwin County, James Gordon. NBC 15 News.